Hey everyone, how are you all doing? I'm really excited to share something amazing with you today. It's a fantastic add-on for our file manager WP file download plugin. It basically works as an extension for WP file download, allowing you to sync files from your cloud storage providers and manage them within your WordPress file download. This tool is incredibly powerful and useful, and the best part is, it's super easy to use. What makes this cloud integration stand out from the others is its seamless integration with Elementor or any other page builder. So, today, I want to give it a try and connect my Google Drive to WP file download to explore all the great features it offers. Alright, let's not waste any more time and dive right into how this awesome plugin actually works. Alright, before we can start using the Google Drive integration, we need to connect our Google Drive account to our file download. So, the first step is to head over to the Configuration section in the File Download tab. Once you're there, click on Cloud Connection. Now, you'll see a few options for cloud connections like Dropbox or OneDrive, but for today, let's focus on Google Drive. You have two modes for connecting, Automatic and Manual. With the Automatic mode, all you need to do is log in once to connect to your Google Drive. It's a simple process without any complications. However, if you choose the manual option, you'll have to create your own app on the Google Developer Console. This method takes more time, but it allows you to optimize and customize your own app according to your preferences. For now, let's go with the automatic connection option. It will save you the trouble of creating your own app on the Google Developer Console. Once you've made your selection, you'll notice a connect button in the upper right corner of the tab. Just give it a click. Follow the necessary steps, including access limitations, and log into your Google Drive account. Once you've completed that, we're all set and ready to go. Now that the connection is complete, your WP file download is synced with your cloud, specifically Google Drive in this case. This means that when you connect your Google Drive account to your WordPress site, you not only have access to your Google Drive storage files, but you can also manage and organize them directly within WordPress. Let me illustrate this with an example. I've just created a new category and uploaded several files within that category on WordPress. Now, let's switch to my Google Drive tab and navigate to my WP file download, which will have a similar name. As you can see, the folder and files I uploaded to WordPress earlier are also present here. This demonstrates that your Google Drive and WordPress are fully synchronized with each other. By having this synchronization between the two applications, you save time that would otherwise be spent on re-uploading your files from WP to Drive. Additionally, you gain access to advanced management features, which can significantly enhance your workflow efficiency. Now that the connection is complete, your WP file download is synced with your cloud, specifically Google Drive in this case. This means that when you connect your Google Drive account to your WordPress site, you not only have access to your Google Drive storage files, but you can also manage and organize them directly within WordPress. Let me illustrate this with an example. I've just created a new category and uploaded several files within that category on WordPress. Now, let's switch to my Google Drive tab and navigate to my WP file download, which will have a similar name. As you can see, the folder and files I uploaded to WordPress earlier are also present here. This demonstrates that your Google Drive and WordPress are fully synchronized with each other. By having this synchronization between the two applications, you save time that would otherwise be spent on re-uploading your files from WP to Drive. Additionally, you gain access to advanced management features, which can significantly enhance your workflow efficiency. The Google Drive integration not only provides full synchronization with file download but also acts as an extension storage for other file download features. WP File Download offers dedicated widgets for popular page builders like Elementor and DV. Today, I'm going to give it a try and see how Google Drive integration works with these widgets specifically on my Elementor page. To begin, I'll access my Elementor page and search for the corresponding file download widgets, WP file download file, WP file download category, and WP file download search engine. Let's start with the category widget. After adding the widget block to my page, I'll insert the Google Drive category and preview it on my page. The category will be displayed like this, with each file having its own download and preview button. 
The preview button allows you to get a glimpse of the file before interacting with or downloading it, while the download button, as the name suggests, enables you to download the file to your device. This is how a regular category is displayed with the default theme. However, if you prefer a different theme that better suits your page design, you can follow these steps. Go back to the File Download Plugin page, right-click on the category you inserted in the Elementor page, and select Edit Category. Here, you'll find additional available themes. For now, I'll choose this theme, save the changes, and reload my page to see the result. Each theme comes with its own unique design, so you can pick the one that suits your preferences and page aesthetics. Another widget that is available for file download and integrated with page builders is the WP File Download File widget. As the name suggests, this widget allows you to insert a single file from a category of your choice. Let me demonstrate how it works by adding a widget block on my Elementor page and selecting a file from my Google Drive category. After that, I'll go to the preview page to see how the file will be displayed. Similar to the previous widget, WP File Download File also provides the file with a download button and a preview button, and their functions are similar as well. Earlier, I mentioned the availability of more advanced options in the Edit Category section. Now, let's take a closer look at one of the most significant settings here, Access Limitation. With this setting, you have the ability to define specific permissions regarding file downloads, updates, deletions, and even restrict access to certain files or file categories for specific WordPress users. On the front end, it's easy for me to configure the visibility for admin groups and specify which user roles are allowed to access the files. Additionally, I can enhance the security by setting passwords, ensuring that only users with the appropriate roles and passwords can access the files and folders. On the admin side, I have complete control over user rights related to file management. For instance, in the Google Drive category I inserted into Elementor earlier, I can set the access limit to private. This means that only users with selected roles will be able to see and access the files. To add an extra layer of security to your files, you can set passwords for them. This can be done in the permission settings of the category, whether the files are public or private. Once a password is set, anyone who wants to access the files must enter the correct password. The final widget I'd like to discuss today is the WP Search Engine. When you're dealing with a large number of files, searching for a specific file within categories can be quite a hassle. On the other hand, displaying all the files on your page can make things appear messy. That's where the search engine widget comes in handy. This widget serves as a powerful tool that allows you to easily browse through your categories and quickly locate the specific file you're looking for. To further streamline the search process, it also offers filter options, making file management much easier and more efficient. To wrap things up, let's take a look at the pricing for the plugin. In addition to all the plugin features we just covered, the WP File Download plugin offers many third parties plugin integration like DV Builder, Gutenberg, and Elementor, which I demonstrated earlier in this video. There are also other cloud connectors like Dropbox, OneDrive, or OneDrive Business. The plugin is available for $49, which includes all the file management features. But if you want to use the cloud connectors add on, for example, like Google Drive, you'll need to upgrade to the $69 option. Thanks for watching this video. If you're watching this video from YouTube, don't forget to subscribe to our channel to stay informed about new plugin features and ask us any questions using the comments. And of course, you'll find all the useful links we've talked about in the description. Have a productive day, bye.